Hey guys, and welcome back to another video. So today I wanted to get into Creative Sim and just kind of chill and do a cast challenge that I've attempted before. I don't actually know if this is a proper cast challenge, at least not that I know of, maybe it is, and I just don't know the name of it. But essentially what we're gonna do here is make a sim using only presets, but you can't use sliders or anything of the sort. If this is already a challenge, please let me know, but I don't think I've seen anything about that. Also, I'm trying out new default eyes, and I'm still not sure how I feel about it. I don't know which ones these are. I'll let you guys know uh, on the screen probably, or in the description, but I'm just trying to find something new because I've been using the same ones for a very long time, so I don't know, and I love the ones that I use so I just oh no it's doing this thing again why so basically we just got to pick some presets and do I make it so that we stick to just one no I'm not gonna make it that because this isn't like the no mistakes challenge type thing I actually kind of like these oh it's gonna be hard to I mean I can adjust this I can adjust the sim as much as I want as far as like what presets I use I want to try and make a sim that I wouldn't normally try and make but then again, I'll probably end up making a sim that I usually make. <laughs> this nose is kind of cute. Wait. I feel like it won't be too difficult. Especially with the amount of variety of presets I have. Maybe this would be more of a challenge if I just used presets from like base game or something like that. Although then I feel like the sims will all just look the same. It's going to be hard with some of these lips that you actually need to adjust. So maybe I have to pick something that I don't really need too much adjusting with. I have like so many options to pick from. These ones are really like, cute and small. Maybe we'll do this. And then we'll do cheeks, which actually can help a lot too with changing faces. Uh, which I didn't honestly, originally, I didn't realize how much this actually impacts uh, your Sims faces, like doing the cheeks and everything like that. But like you can tell a difference. I kinda like this one because it kind of sucks in right near the mouth, which makes it seem like she's sort of puckering them. Well, let's check jawline which one do i want for her maybe we work on chin first although i don't necessarily mind her little chin <gasps> do we do a little i was gonna say a little button <laughs> a button chin which is not what it's called but isn't it more of a cleft it's also the fact that i can't really like go in and change the size of the eyes as well uh i can do the forehead or head shape actually Oh my god, wait, that made her head so much smaller. Is this what she had before? I don't know. Oh, wait. I think I want this. She looks kind of like concerned <laughs> a little bit. Okay, ears. Oh, right. My ear pre presets, they all look the same. I think they're like broken or something. But I do have these ones by Lumia, which I might do. Oh, <gasps> wait. I do like these. She's not looking too bad. So let me do body preset. Oh, I just realized I can't really adjust this. I mean, I guess the only sliders that I can really use is these if I want to. Well, no, because I have to use just presets. So that would be messing with it. That would be a slider. So let's not do that. Oh, sometimes the presets, when you overlay them, it kind of messes them up. Hold on. That's the only thing with body presets I've noticed. Okay, I think I might do this one. This one's different than what I think I've ever used, really, actually. Wait, I've never seen a preset make the butt look like that. Wait, I kind of live. Okay, wait. What? This preset's so good! Which one is this? Oh, I don't even know. I probably made a video on it at some point. I have I have a couple preset videos out. I do need to make an updated one with other presets because I've definitely gotten way more. Now we give you hair. Oh, brows. Do we give you brows first or we, what do we do? I guess I- well, no, I guess I can't adjust the brows either because that would be also messing with the preset itself. <laughs> Ooh, I kind of like those. I don't know what hair color we're gonna do. I think we'll decide that once we get to the hair portion. We'll just do brown for now or just keep it at black and we'll see. But I'm gonna give her a skin. I feel like her nose is gonna look really cute once we add like blush and stuff to it. This skin has been like my go-to lately. But do I wanna really go this route again? I may wanna switch it up a little bit at least. What about this one? I'm like so indecisive when it comes to this. Let me quickly just do like blush and stuff add to her oh, she looks so cute i will do like a softer cupid's bow i think and then oh the smile i do kind of like how it like accentuates her corners i'm gonna do the medium one i feel like she kind of looks like a sim that i wouldn't normally make 
Would you guys agree? I don't know. Am I making that up? I don't, I couldn't tell you. Oh, dimples? I love me some dimples, but maybe none for her. How about teeth? I have seen some other teeth that are like even more so realistic, which I low-key want to get. I think it's, they're by someone called Magic Bat, I want to say. I could be wrong, but that sounds like it's right. <laughs> so I do want to look into some more teeth for sure, because I feel like I've had the same ones for a really long time. And I'd like to see more. I don't think uh, many people really make teeth. At least not from what I've seen. Oh, wait, these lashes. I kind of think I'm vibing with these these default eyes. Actually, let me see what other colors look like. Oh, I do have... Oh, yeah, those are Halloween. Okay, these are other eyes. I don't know which ones are which because I have some other non-default. Oh, the green looks so pretty. Are you kidding me? I had another default eye that I was, I think I had it in my, uh, what's it called? The Monster High Create a Sim, but I wasn't really, I, I liked them, but I think they were a little bit too realistic for me. Uh, even though I do like my realistic eyes. What if I just make this sim more Maxis this time around? Do we do that? Something different for a change? <laughs> Maybe we add some sort of, yeah, moles. I don't know if this one's gonna work considering it's, <gasps> Actually, it works. I didn't think it. Oh, yes. Oh, wait. Okay, I so want to give her these. But which one? There's so many to pick. I really like that. Is that too much? I feel like I don't mind the nose being like softly emphasized. Maybe I stick with the one from this. That one's, I think, a bit softer because I could just adjust it, right? Let's go find a hair. I actually need to go CC shopping. I feel like every time I talk to you guys when I'm making a cast, I'm like, yeah, I gotta go CC shopping, but I really do, actually. Like, it's been a minute. I wish that hair and lashes wouldn't, like, mesh like that. Cause then it's like, it's a cute hair, but then the lashes look all wonky. I want her ears to show at least. Like I don't want to hide her ears. So I want to find a hair that will emphasize them. Oh, I used this hair recently on a sim which I did record, so I'm debating, maybe I'll upload that at some point as well. Love that sim, by the way. And I kind of want to make her a girlfriend, so maybe if I make her a girlfriend, um, then I can share the cast. Unless, what if this girl can be her girlfriend? Hmm, could be, could be. Why is hair literally the hardest part for me? <laughs> like, there's just so many to pick from, and it's where I struggle the most. This hair is gorgeous. I made a sim using this, also did not upload her, but the sim that I made kind of reminded me of like Adina and Bella Hadid combo, which maybe I could upload her too, but I just didn't think she was good enough to share. I don't know. Sometimes I've just become way too critical of the content that I make and I think it's hurting me more than anything because like I just want to share things and I'm just like, is it good enough? You know? And like before, I used to not care. So why do I care so much now? I don't know. And I wish I could like stop because I'm not enjoying that about myself. So yeah, but that's my own problems that I've been dealing with it <laughs> for a while now. Uh, I don't know. I kind of like the blonde on her actually. The black does look really nice on her, but something about the blonde. All right, so I was editing this video and I started like looking back at how my sim looked with minimal makeup and everything. And I think I prefer that to when I glammed her up, which I'll show you guys her, the version that I ended up with when I initially finished the video. But I was like, no, I'm not really feeling it as much. And so I think I'm just gonna go with a little bit more minimal uh, instead of her being super done up. I mean, I feel like her other look could definitely be more like for going out and stuff, but I do like the blonde on her, I think a bit more. Like I'm still going back and forth between the blonde and the black, but also she does look really good as a brunette, but I wanna try and get out of me constantly doing brown or black hair, so maybe blonde will be fine. Let me do something like very soft and I want to do a different outfit as well. So yeah, not that I didn't like what she had on before, but I just, I don't know. I think she just is, her face is very soft and I don't feel like she needs to be super done up. Um, so let me get something else 
that I think will look good. Honestly, my gut is saying to give her these hoops because I literally give them to, oh, <laughs> give them to everyone, <laughs> but these are floating off her ear. That's the only issue with picking earrings for these ear presets is some of them are just hanging off the literal bottom of their earlobe. So this might be a little bit of a task to find earrings that suit. Uh, yeah, it might be a little bit of a problem. Oh wait, I wonder if these will work. Oh, you can sort of see them. I wish you could see the hoop on the other ear as well, but you can't. I mean, I guess you like, this would work. Like, yeah, it's the hair's cutting through, but like normally if you're wearing earrings, your hair is like gonna be covering them anyways, unless you have like an updo. So maybe we do stick with this. I don't think this hair comes with, yeah, it's just either in the front or pushed back. But I like being able to see the other earring as well, even though it looks a little awkward, but I think I can manage with that. I think we'll do this. All right, and then when it comes to makeup, she did have this liner originally, but I mean, maybe we do brown and tone it down. Oh, the brown looks pretty. Okay, we'll do brown. Let's see, for lips, maybe like a soft gloss. Like almost her natural lips with a little shine. Yeah, I think I like that. Okay, and now for a casual outfit because I think I was going a little bit too fancy for her. Not that it's, I mean, of course it's okay, but I wanna try something different. Oh my God, I think she's so cute. And the fact that I didn't even use any sliders either, like not even one. Oh, I'm obsessed. Now I kind of want her to date the other sim that I made. I'm not gonna lie. Low key could see them being a couple. <laughs> so maybe I'll end up posting that create a sim. And like sometimes I have the want to like play a household, which I mean, I think it's completely normal, but then I'm just like, oh, but I have these other households, like my whimsy and my high school years, which obviously I haven't been really consistent with them, but I've already mentioned, it's just like, I need to be in the mood to play and I don't want to force myself to play, which is why there's such big gaps, which I don't intend for it, but I just, yeah. And I feel like a broken record when I bring this up every time, but it's a genuine way that I feel. I just, I, I want to play when I'm feeling like playing. <laughs> so, you know, there is that, but I mean, it is what it is. I mean, I feel like I could probably find a cute top for this. It's a little baggy on the butt, but <laughs> I don't think it's all too bad. Wait. That's pretty though. I love this top. We could do like a cute necklace with this. Although I really am liking this top, but I just don't think it works with these pants. Unless I find pants that work with it. What do you like? Speak to me, girl. I wanna know. <laughs> or do we go like cozier? Cause like it's fall time coming into winter. Gotta refrain from the green because my instinct is telling me go green, but I mean, which is good, go green. But like I've been doing a lot of green in Kaz. Ooh, wait, what about this? Oh, I kind of like the pattern, but we have pattern going on with the pants. I did have these pants originally on her for the other outfit, but in black. I think I like her way better now than I did before. But does anybody else do this? Like they make a sim and then you kind of retract everything. You're like, well, maybe she looked better earlier because I feel like when I looked back at the footage, I was like, I think this just looks suits her so much better. Like, I feel like this is more her than what I initially had. But now my problem is, do I do the brown pants or the pink? I feel like the pink brightens up the look. The brown kind of keeps it more fall and muted. Let's try shoes first before I commit to something. I've never used these yet. Not that I will for this look, but I do want to use them at some point. I mean, I have a lot of shoes that I haven't really used a lot. Like these, I probably should get rid of them because I don't use sliders. Although I love how like extra they are. It's just realistically, girl, are you gonna use them? No, cause their feet are literally in the floor, <laughs> but they're cool. Like you could wear sandals in fall. Yeah, we'll do the sandals, give you some nails. And, oh, I like that's like a, I was gonna say mauve, but that's not really a mauve color. Oh yeah, I'm liking her way better now. Okay, <gasps> oh, I could see this, like a gold with a pearl. Oh yes, I like that. She's so cute. Okay, I think I'm content with this version of her. This is what I originally did, which I don't think she looks bad. I just don't think I'm vibing with her nearly as much. Like this could be like maybe a going out look. Do you know what I mean? It's the same Sim, but she looks so much better to me. Like, oh, I love her. Oh, okay, I'm happy now. <laughs> Cause I was editing the videos like, oh, I'm not really vibing with 
the rest of it so i was like i might just go in and like change it but um let me know if you guys like version well i'm gonna call this version one even though this technically is version two but do you guys like this version or this version better okay because i think i like this one a lot better but uh yeah so that's pretty much it for this video thank you guys so much for watching hope you guys enjoyed if you did don't forget to consider a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already and i'll talk to you guys in a video very soon bye guys